Okay, so today I will be teaching you basically how to make an overlay um, title, but with, um, you can either do a background, a moving background on the text without the moving background being on the actual clip of your film. So what I started first was I created another sequence with just the text I wanted, and then um, I brought in a film burn and I put it over top of it. And um, depending on what kind of look you're going for with it, you can um, change the composite mode, but I liked the look that the multiply gave me. And, um, and you have to be careful because some of the other composite modes, the film burn actually goes on the background as well, which you don't want when you overlay it with um, a clip of the film. So I couldn't just drag this in and put it over top of the clip because the, then the film burn would actually affect the clip and I didn't want that to happen. So I had to uh, nest them together and then bring them back into uh, um, the original scene that I wanted to. And um, then, so this is the clip that I nested with the ones that I showed you. And then I didn't want the thing just to be wide on here. I kind of wanted the background of the clip um, to show through a little as well. So I um, put this on the add composite mode so that you could still see a little of the background, but it also had the film burn going at the same time. So it created kind of a, oh, well, now it's unrendered, but um, kind of like the text was overlaid on the, on the clip, but then there was an overlay on the text as well. And I just did that through composite modes and nesting. So thank you. The end. <laughs>